different spheres going across the screen. They, they, re they represent the sun. And they go from the left side of the screen to the right side of the screen. And there's three, there's three of them. One of them, this one, represents the, 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 represents, the out, represents the hours that have passed since the beginning of the day. The, sec the second one represents the minutes that have passed since the, since the start of the last hour. And the last one that's constantly ticking at every second is the number of seconds that have passed, passed since the last minute started. And together, these three sphere, spheres define a de, 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 define a de, de, define unique. I, you, de, together, these three spheres define unique isobar bar, bars based on the distance of, er, of er, every pixel to each of the three the three spheres. And by viewing by view by viewing the by viewing the the by, view, by viewing the iso bar bars. You can also see 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 their their perpendicular effects that appear appear, which would correspond to the to to the line the lines of a the lines of a Vernori Nori diagram. Um, and and so every so every time one one of these values it, 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 it elapses, it goes back to the left. And to get together, there's, there's a there's a, together together there's there there's a unique image generated for every single second of the day. And you can kind of you 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 can kind of use use you you use viewing this watch to show you to show you to show you, show you kind of how much time is elapsed left lapsed for a certain time frame. So by looking for, looking at the top at the at, at the top circle, you can kind of you can see how much how much of the day how much of the day has elapsed. Now now right now right now it's in the evening. Evening, the sun's gone down, down, down because the hour, hour sphere is, is 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 starting to get closer to the end of the day. And say you wanted to do a, you're doing a homework assignment or you had some sort of t task at the job at the job that you need that you need to need to do and you had you had an hour to complete. You can you can you you can you you can use you can use the second sphere to see to see how how far how far along of that time you've used. If you want to time someone doing some sort of running, running where they only need to need to go for a minute, you can use the last last one. But I think I think it was a good exploration of a good exploration of of kind of re re rendering the same images I would render on my computer on, on the watch face. Um, I was I was originally planning on using a using a using a dithering al al algorithm to show great gray grayscale gray gray rendered images or or maybe even 3D Im Im images on uh, up on the Pebble watch face, but but unfortunately I was not able to get the the array functionality working within the within the Pebble def development environment. For 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 for, for whatever re reason the the app the app cra cra crashed even even when I tried to do use the most sim simplest of arrays. So so I. So here we are. Here we are with this ISO bar app, which is which is fun. Um, thank you for listening. I hope you have a great a great day. Goodbye.